Uh, hi there. My name is Wifey Well, but you may call me Wifey, and today we're back playing some more of Fallout 4. Last episode, I was working on my manor. I got the, uh, back porch, the balcony, rather, the balcony, um, set up. I'm actually really happy with it, even though it's just a metal square, but anyway. And then I began work on my roof. And I, I did decide to record this one right after the last one just because in the summertime it's always really hard to get recording done. So I have to kind of just take it when I can and get stuff, you know, situated for the week. Um, this stuff's gone. Why? Well, it is because during the last episode I got a notification about Ten Pines Bluff being attacked. And I think I told them to be a strong independent settlement <laughs> if I recall correctly um and then sure enough it said like I failed and they were damaged or something oh my god okay it's um super mutant time no don't do the head don't panic the torso oh this is bad this is really bad this is our Tato place. Look at these, like, badass settlers, though. Is there more? So, yeah, when I saw that the place actually took damage, um, like, I guess I thought it was optional in my head, because, you know, I'm an idiot. I was like, I better load my last autosave when I slept. I didn't make any progress on the roof anyhow. Oh, I got him right in the gut. No more snacks for him. Where is the next Shrek at? Are we good? I hear fighting. Uh, I see a health bar. Shrek, where are you? Did you get him? Oh, he was over here. I didn't see him. I still don't see him. Where? I don't know. So is it done? Preston still has his gun out. Are we good? Everyone happy? I guess so. So one thing I've learned is to take their... Take everyone's weapons. Granted, I don't know if boards count, but... Take their weapons and scrap them. That way, um, it doesn't fill up the world. It will, like, slowly glitch the world. Such, you know, things like that. So, um, also with the settlement size glitch, I guess if I take them, drop them in, say, the sanctuary, scrap them in the sanctuary, it'll reduce my settlement size, so that's good. Where are those other super mutant bodies? That is a log. Here's one. Oops. Oh my god. What is all that noise? Do you hear that? Nothing? Is the game freezing? I don't know what's happening. Well, I thought I heard more bullets, but I guess not. So anyway, my uh, objective of this episode was to be uh, getting more glass and just more things in general. I need to learn what is good to scrap and I've been told and I know there's certain things like always grab wonder glue and duct tape and such. Those are starting to stick in my head, thank goodness. Um, so this settlement, oh, we have a level up. This settlement size glitch. So what, drop these, one, two, three. What was the crappy weapon we picked up? I think this one. Yeah. And then we could drop this. 
So bam, there's some garbage. Go into here. The size is already like over half full. And then we just start scrapping stuff. And it's supposed to reduce the size. I'm not sure if it actually is. Plus I'm doing it wrong, which... Oh no, it went down. I saw it. Hooray. I'm learning. Slowly but surely. Something else um, that I was told quite a few episodes ago, um, but I've been meaning to do it. People that aren't assigned to anything, I need to get them running on a supply line. How come you, the queue for supply line, was marked out? But you, I can make you do it. I can make Shuffle do it. Hey, Shuffle, actually, you know what? Maybe they can't go because they were like the starter settlers. I don't know. Like, I'd like. Okay, you can go, so that's not the case. Why can't you go over here if you're not assigned to anything? Sturge is unassigned. Maybe you're just important for like a quest or something. I don't know. Okay, who wants to be my errand boy? I was thinking Sheffield, um, but I kind of relate to Sheffield. You know, we're both, we're both cola lovers. Um, so I'd like to see him ar around when I come home. That leaves Mama Murphy's doing the food. Sturgis is a no, no, and Codsworth is a no. There's the cranky girl. And then the guy that I thought I saw come in here. Yeah, you're, you can be a sign. Oh, he's very sad. I can't make him do it. Where's that girl that is mean? I need to ring the dinner bell. Oh, wait, is that her? No, that's Kate. Dinner. I have a nice helping of air for dinner for everybody. Toxic air at that. Okay, Sheffield's coming. Where is the girl? She might already be assigned to this tower, whatever I put over here. Oh, I got rid of the tower. That's right. I don't know where that girl is. Is she come? Oh, is that her? I think that's her. Hey, Miss Cranky Pants, are you interested in doing um, some supply lines for me? Yeah, she can go. Okay. It does say she's assigned to food, though. Unassigned, unassigned, unassigned. I thought you were assigned to food. Assigned to being a person? What the heck does that mean? Okay. Well, Marcy has a job, apparently, and Sheffield, um, he has a job just being my relatable person. Sturgis is destined to be unemployed, and Codsworth is Codsworth, so that only leaves you, buddy. I'm sorry, I know you're very upset, but maybe you'll find the meaning to life as you travel on the road. So, um... Let's see, and we're not going to be messing around in Starlight Drive-In for a bit. Since Tin Pines Bluff has our potatoes and everything, why don't you just go there? Assign supply line to Tin Pines Bluff. Confirm. Goodbye. Enjoy, enjoy life. Assigned to being a cattle. I'm sorry, Kate. All right, so that's done. That's something that's been on my little to-do list. Um, we need to level up. I was recently told about the uh, scrapper perk, which will come in handy for getting materials and such. Hmm, I don't know where it is. Here it is. Salvage uncommon components like screws, aluminum, and copper when scrapping weapons and armor. But I'm too stupid for it. So. 
I guess we'll just put a point into intelligence. Although, what about where's local leader? Build stores and workstations. We're level 14 now and everything. I'm going to get this one for now. Just because I want it. <laughs> and now it's done. And maybe what I should do instead of running around is build some workstations. Because if I'm remembering right, I think if I build some workstations and assign some extra settlers to it, such as Sheffield, they'll like go out and get stuff and then I won't have to necessarily go out and get stuff. Maybe. We are going to find out. So these are stores. Crafting. Armor, workbench, chemistry, cooking. Um, I have to get some Nuka-Cola machines put in. Scavenging station. Extra scavenging production. Yeah. Hmm. Let's go put this at my house. So that when we fast travel here from now on, we'll be where I want to be, where the action is. I don't think it wants to go there because of the door, of course. Oh, you still don't want to live. I don't want to put it in the door because... Oh, I guess it's going to go like right there. I'm not happy, but it can go there. So back to what I was saying. I feel very distractible today. More distractible than usual, perhaps. Guess I'll just plop one of those bad boys there. And get shuffled on it. If I can find him. There he is. He knew I was talking about him. Hey buddy, old pal. Um, I want you to, uh... You're gonna come over here and you're gonna do... Whatever this workstation job is. Enjoy. The resource is now assigned. Cool. So I've also heard we need to plant more than just Tato's. Such a betrayal as the almighty holy Tato's has provided us with so much. But that's fine. We can plant some other things. I guess there we go. There's a patch of grass. Wait, why is this one so... This one is so much more manageable. Um... How come this isn't... Okay, so it shows the Tato's has a person, the melons have a person. Oh, this Tato doesn't. Oh, no. Some of our Tato's aren't being worked, and I guess neither is this giant razor grain. Put the little baby razor grain there. We'll put some mutt fruits in back here we've got melons um we don't have any gourds or corn when you get corn water we have the water pump okay garden plot 
Brahmin feed trough. Brahmin will tend to stay near their feed trough. But where do we get the Brahmin? Oh, we have to catch the Brahmin. That's right. That's right. Oh, that's another resource we could go look for. I really want cats. Hmm. Okay. So local leader, I think it said I can make these stores now, right? I have no idea what they're about, but produces income based on the total population and makes settlements happier. Do all of these just make income? Okay, so trading stand, shop, 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 emporium. Ooh, we need cap collector as well. Okay, I kind of like this one. It says it requires someone to work on it. Uh, we don't know if we have anybody. Maybe we need to build a trade beacon. Wait a minute, could Codsworth be our little trader boy? Codsworth. Where are you, love? Where is my robot boy? Hmm. <gasps> Codsworth, hi! Codsworth, you're very charming and I'd like you to sell everything. The resource is now assigned. This makes me very happy. He is amazing. Look at him. He's such a hard little worker. Ooh, hi, Codsworth. I love it. It's getting dark, so I'm going to go. Well, maybe I don't need to take a nap. Maybe I need to just go find my supplies. Maybe I need to do some more quests because I am worried about... Things getting, um, spoiled for me. I guess and this is the main quest, I believe. Where is it on the map? The Starlight Drive-In? That can't be right. That just doesn't seem right. Continue following the Freedom Trail. R. There's like a square here. Maybe I can't continue the main quest yet. Or maybe it is at Starlight Drive-In. Hold on, maybe I have my marker. Uh, I had my marker placed. Okay, well. I guess. I will be. Very unenthusiastically. Looking for some soft Meyerlurk meat. Also, I was told these people are really cool. Don't remember why they were cool besides their name. They have something to do with fixing up. And they were cool for some reason. Maybe we travel down there if we stick to the coast and try and find some. Oh, geez, we're far. Try and find some Mirelurk meat. Okay. Last time we were around here, it was very, very bad. So hopefully we can get through here without uh, dying. That, that would be preferable. So what, we need to go east? 
Gosh, I feel like we haven't been, um... Ugh. I feel like we haven't been just out adventuring in forever. Been doing so much building and such. Which is fine. But now I feel like a lost little lamb. I'm very nervous. Um, Gunner Conscript? Oh, are you talking to me? I'm, I'm, I'm leaving, but like, why is there a robot shooting at me? Oh. It's a hospital. They're hogging. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Well, this is going well. Uh-oh. Oh god, wrong key. Well, you know, I... I knew this is how this would go, damn it. I guess let's try this again. Maybe we can avoid that hospital this time. But, you know, by avoiding that trouble, we'll probably just find additional trouble somewhere else. Legendary Raider. Oh no, 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 no. No, sir. I'm just gonna move it along. Medical Center Metro. Oh god. I think Preston decided to stay and fight, maybe. Is that a baddie? Yes. Oh, this place is so dangerous. Um. Slim? Don't I know your name? Don't I know you? Hey, Slim. You got that look. Like you jonesing for something. Um, I'm jonesing. Use your workbench. Mind if I use your workbench? Sure, why not? Maybe take that into consideration when you're thinking about what to buy. Hey, Slim. Looking to score? I got what you need. Um, is that all you have is chems? Chems all you got. Nah, that's just all that most people around here are interested in. Let me show you my wares. I just feel like I remember Slim. Oh wait, how many stimmies do I have? Since apparently that's gonna be an issue. Oh, I'm I'm fine. Who was Slim? Preston. If only I could remember. Maybe I haven't met him before. Maybe I'm thinking of another game. I don't know. Do you know what? Okay. I do know since we made it this far without dying again, we should probably uh, do a little bit of quick saving. Um, yeah, I'm trying to build a settlement. Don't see you helping. Okay, we need to get... We need to get scooched over. We need to get to the water, but... 
Worried about activating whatever that was. Eh. Wait. Wait a minute. Where am I? Red rocket? Is this a settlement? Because I feel like I have seen mention of this when I did watch some settlement building videos. Or am I being stupid? We haven't been down this way. It's not popping up as a... Like, it's not going, bing, he found the red rocket. But look, there's a power armor thing. Mr. Handy Fuel. Rat poison. There's a lot of stuff here. Is this just a settlement? But like... I don't know. I don't want to take anything out of it yet. I don't know, it's not blipping up. I don't know. Let's just stick to the plan, get to the water, hope for some Meyer lurks, go visit the cool cats or whatever they were called. Gunner? Again? Because last time we met a gunner, Mr. Gutsy, and he tore us up. Not coming yet. There's only one? Okay. Hey, I did my critical. I heard the noise for one. Military checkpoints. So Andrew Station is marked. It was like pre-marked even though I haven't found it. I don't know if I should pop over here and get it to blip up for us. So that whenever we do whatever is here later. We can just, you know, poof here. Okay, Andrew Station. Good. Now, can we get to the water? Maybe I should quick save again before we die. What the H? Uh. Okay. You know, we're actually out of time anyway. I guess I'm going to figure out which way we should go next time. Because um, like I said, we're out of time for this episode. And I don't really want to step into this just yet. So as always, I hope that you enjoyed. I appreciate you being a well watcher. And I will see you again very soon. Bye.